What is going on YouTube? I'm out here in Arizona on a little break. Uh, fixing to get rolling again here in a few minutes, but I uh, wanted to talk to you real quick about macro lenses again and uh, why size matters. This here is a 60 millimeter micro Nikkor on the D780. And uh, I'll tell you, it's a great. A little loud there, sorry about that. It's a great standard lens. It's really sharp, good carry around lens. It'll be a good all day lens, real light. It's a fair macro lens. It's real sharp, I mean, you get if you get the subject there, it's there, but because it's so short, you gotta put the lens almost up on your subject, about two inches away for a true one to one. Now, whereas with a 150 millimeter lens, you can be 18 inches away for a one to one. That's a big difference, but this is lightweight, whereas that 150 is a chunk to carry around. It's a couple of pounds. So, this right here, it's like a Swiss Army knife. It does everything, may not do it all great, but it does everything. It's really sharp though, good contrast. I mean, as a, as a standard lens, if I was gonna walk around on the street, this thing is fantastic. Uh, so I, I got good things to say about it there. It's still a good macro lens. If it's the only lens you had for macro, it'd be great. Just better need to be patient because you're going to have a fun time sneaking up on stuff. But if it's still got good light, you'd be good with it. The, only, the one thing to be said about it, though, is that that's the other thing. You get so close that if you're not careful, you block your own light. So that's another thing that's in its negative category. But they're cheap. You can get one for a couple hundred bucks. They're sharp. And on a DX, it's a great portrait lens. If you got a crop sensor camera, this is a fantastic portrait lens. So let's get out and shoot some more. Enjoy. All right, headed back to the truck. And uh, this is the quick add on here. I was able to sneak up on a damselfly, which I've never been able to do before. Uh, so that's a plus. Uh, maybe the small size and I didn't like as big of a threat, so it didn't move off as fast. So, once again, it's, it is a usable macro lens. Uh, not the greatest for insects, but definitely usable. But absolutely fantastic for still subjects. Still life, doing macro in the studio, stuff where you have controlled light. Fantastic lens for that.